What's up? This is Red the Bad Guy again with another video. This video is about Officer Holloman interview with Fox News 26 Houston. My comments. This is the interview people was waiting for. This interview with Officer Holloman about the Passport Brothers and him being accused of sex trafficking and, or the Passport Brothers being accused of just sex trafficking. Um, the first part was with the women, interview with the women. Now this part is with Austin Holloman. So, um, I guess it starts out, you know, the host, you know, he was, you know, I guess he was trying to link the movement to sex trafficking, of course. And then he started asking uh, questions. And first question he asked him is, um, um, did you ever give money to these women for sex? And he said, no. But then Austin came back around and said that there are some men that do that. Then the host asked him again, you know, um, did you say that it was easy for men to get women over in Brazil for sex? He said, no, I didn't say easy. I meant they're easy to get along with. But then eventually in the video, he said that I did say that. But he didn't say that he didn't want to start off with that. Uh, so, I mean, it's kind of backtracking. Um, then the host asked him, um, are you the leader of the Passport Brothers? Austin said, no, I'm not. There's no set leader. You know, he asked him, um, are you staying in Thailand? Because, you know, after he got kicked out of Brazil, he went to Thailand. He said, no, I'm just, I'm just here visiting, I guess. Um, next thing he asked him about his income. Um, your income, where's the basis of your income coming from? Apparently, it's coming from social media, you know, um, from donations, just from that, the channels, you know, the YouTube, Facebook. Uh, he got kicked off of TikTok, I think Twitter, or whatever. I, you know, Twitter, I think he's still on, I guess. Um, so if the machine want to get rid of him, all they got to do is just knock his YouTube channel out and and Facebook and that's it for him and stuff. Um, he should have more than one income, you know, We're just not solely depending on social media. But you know, there's a lot of people that you know live off, make their money off of social media. So I mean, what can you say? You know, can't hate. <laughs> <laughs> So the next question um, he asked him is about women cooking, you know, the difference between American women and women overseas. And, um, he said that the women um, don't cook over here and stuff, and you know, they're not kind, you know, they're not reasonable and stuff. And he go over there, it's way different and stuff like that to even cook, you know. And then you don't even have to cook over there because, you know, um, your money, because of you American, you know, with the currency rate and stuff, um, you can eat out all the time. You don't have to worry about cooking. So, and um, that's what I'm saying about that, you know. And then, um, and then the host asked him about his age. And, and Austin said he was 23 years old, and he said, oh, man, come on, man, you're 23, you're just starting out, you know, and he was just surprised that, I guess, maybe, just like the rest of us older dudes, we surprised that a guy so young checking out already, you know, in marriage, and dealing with women over here, and dating, the dating scene, and all that, and he just, just left, you know, um, it's crazy, it's crazy, so, People tell me what you think. So what do you think? This interview, I'm going to put the link down below. You can go check it out and stuff. I'm sure people are going to analyze this. You know, um, this is my comments, you know. Um, now, the Passport Brothers is going to say this is a victory and stuff. He made us look good and stuff, you know, because they're looking for a hero, even though Austin said that he's not the leader. 
they probably gonna make him leave it right now. They gonna they gonna praise this video. I'm sure, but these suckers don't know how the machine works and stuff. This is just a, the first interview. The next one is gonna be more. <laughs> That's when the fireworks are gonna happen. I, I'll just say that, you know. So, um, what you think? Tell me what you think. Until next time, I see you later. Peace.